Hello there everybody, it is me Feaser Bunny, and welcome back to episode 63 of Let's Play The Sims 4 Get To Work. Okay guys, I finally managed to get Luca and Kaylee on a date together, thank freaking goodness. I am so happy that both of them are actually hanging out together. So we're gonna go ahead and spend some time over here at the train station bar, which is a venue that I also made myself. I keep plugging myself all the time every time we go on dates and stuff, but yeah, we're gonna go ahead and actually find a nice little table over here. There's some tables over here at the back, which I feel like are really, really romantic. So we're gonna grab a sit seat here together uh, with Luca, and we are going to communicate with him and just pretty much just talk to him to fill up all of our requirements and stuff. Okay, so let's just speed things up for a little bit. Oh, what is she do? Oh, I guess she couldn't sit. Okay, you know what? Let's just sit here, I guess. I don't know. Where's Luca? Oh my gosh, this is... Why does he... Oh, come on. Um, call over. He is so far. There we go. And I guess both of them can... Um, I don't know. I think if I actually just initiate the interactions, they'll, autom they'll automatically sit. If you guys hear that, that is the wind outside my house, by the way. Still a typhoon. Freaking crazy. It's growing really slow. It's been around for like a couple of days already. Um, so it's kind of weird. Anyway, we're going to flirt with him. And it's, it's just really loud. Plus, we're getting some power surges and stuff, which interrupts my uploads. I'm just like, you know, I get I got I got to get the YouTube videos up and stuff. So... Can we just please not do the power surge? Cause my computer doesn't have like... What are, what are those things called? The power surge beeper things? I don't know what those are called, but my computer doesn't have those anymore. Cause I broke mine accidentally, so that's that. Anyway. Um, so we are going to just build up all the romantic interactions pretty much. Uh, embrace. Well, since she did stand up already, I, I guess we can. Um, yeah, I'll just blow a kiss and uh, compliment his appearance and then let's do some friendly interactions as well ask about day oopsie we're our queue is full and then we might even have to go grab some food here and stuff I just want to make sure that everybody at home is taking care of themselves because they usually don't by the way in the last part we just found out that Gavin's actually pregnant I'm so excited. I am so excited. I It's just amazing. And it doesn't look like we can actually grab some food because literally everybody is here. And literally the wind, I feel like, is going to break the glass outside my window. My condominium is facing the ocean. It's a couple of blocks away from the, from the bay. But there's nothing to kind of slow down the wind because there's like no tall buildings in front of it. So I have like a clear um, point from where the wind comes from the ocean. And every time that happens, you know, the wind is really, really strong. I don't know why I'm even bringing this up. But anyway, she needs to pee. Oh, actually, you know what? Yeah. She needs to pee really quickly. So let's do that before something unnecessary happens is all I'm gonna say I should have literally put like some kind of curtain over here or something because literally people outside can see her pee like I can totally see her I'm like that is that is that is not cool anyway the sims don't care anyway so there we go anyway we need to be flirty which is kind of weird how do we actually do we ha no we don't have tea we only have coffee uh, so we're just gonna flirt with him I guess like as much as we kiss his cheek uh, more choices funny and we need to tell him some jokes as well romance and express fondness uh, compliment his appearance of course because he is so hot oh look at that oh you guys can clearly see that he is not into Kaylee. I mean, Kaylee's probably more in love with him than Luca is in love with Kaylee, which is kind of sad. But I mean, I don't know. That happens, right? It's kind of... This relationship is so tragic. It's it's, it's really funny. Um, but I'm pretty sure Luca will learn to appreciate her eventually. 
more choices. How do we make her flirty? And of course, she feels absolutely miserable right now. Stale surroundings, tired. And um, yeah, we need to tell him a couple more jokes. Uh, so let's just inside joke. And then we are going to tell a joke about aliens. And then another. We'll tell a knock knock joke. There we go. I, knock knock jokes always crack me up. It's kind of funny. Look at this. Everybody's dancing and stuff. This is so fun. I wish I would have included like an actual dance floor. Um, you know what? One thing that The Sims 4 does better than The Sims 3 is actually people in venues, which is kind of nice. So yeah, we need to have some deep conversations with him, which I feel like we should probably do outside. Let's actually go here together. Yeah, you know what? Let's just sit here together. <laughs> like that, nobody cares. I was just stay away from that crowd since it's getting a little bit crowded on that side and nobody even is eating anything. There's lots of things to eat, by the way. We have some coffee makers and we have some microwaves over there as well. Anyway, and we need to have some deep conversation. So let's see here. Um, there we go. And then let's do the other one like that as well. Where's he going? Luca, where are you going? Oh, he's moving to be closer to us. Honestly, you guys, I feel like they would totally be a good couple. Honestly, I, 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 I'm so attached to Luca. I kind of, the reason, one of the reasons why I kind of want Luca to be together with a sim who has a good heart is that I feel like Luca is a little bit vain. And if I match him with a sim that's a little bit more humble and a little bit more patient, I think he's going to be a better person for sure. So that's why I'm kind of pushing for this relationship for both of them to work. Because I think it's going to benefit both of them and make both of them better than without each other. You know, the sum of their parts is better than each one of them individually. Okay, let's caress his cheek. More choices. And then I want to make out with him. Where is the option? Offer massage, whatever. And then um, she's also hungry. So while we're here, we might as well actually grab some food. Oh, we can't. Oh, there's no fridge. Whatever. We can order food, I guess. We can um, order chips, I guess. Okay, Kaylee, that's your that's enough talking to him. I wonder their relationship actually did increase quite a bit by like a quarter, which is awesome. And I mean seriously though, literally everybody is in front of this counter. Like what is happening? Okay, there we go. Thank God. Luca, come here and join me. I'm pretty sure you guys heard that. I'm pretty sure you guys heard that. That is what 200 km per hour winds sound like. I've been talking about this like all the time. It's really, really loud. I don't know why. It's kind of creepy, but everybody's used to it. People who live in the Philippines who watch my videos actually completely get what I'm talking about. Because every time there's a typhoon, you know, classes are canceled and, you know, transportation draws to a halt. Um, this episode is literally me talking random stuff, so... Yeah, that's just, this is, I should probably talk more about the game. So anyway, um, I can't wait until we get like a Seasons expansion pack so that we can actually, you know, like, dress our sims in outerwear and stuff. We're gonna do the trick or treat one since I think this is a limited offer and um, I kind of want to milk it. <laughs> okay, so we reached a gold level if you guys saw a, a while ago. It gave us the notification. I'm not surprised, but yeah, I'm happy that we actually got another gold level. I believe this is our second date, so um, more choices, romance, and we are going to give him one more kiss, and then um, I guess we can call it a night or something. Ooh, what's this? Spooky time shenanigans. If there's anything more fun than sharing a joke with someone else, it's having fun at their expense. Cool, cool beans. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and actually send Kaylee back home. It's already 4 a.m. 
it's time for her to go to bed and i will see you guys in someone's active work they were probably gonna spend some time with jace okay guys so i'll see you in just a second oh my gosh i just thought i would give you guys a little bit of an update as to gavin's pregnancy state and it is so hilarious this is kind of crazy uh, but we still have that moodlet which is kind of interesting it it's basically telling me that yes he is in fact pregnant uh so yeah so we were telling me like it's the same one that we had previously so yeah that's pretty much it everybody is pretty much just taking care of themselves we're gonna spend time with jace okay so i'm gonna go ahead and cut right here and i will see you guys when we are back at the police station okay guys Alrighty, guys we are back at the police station and i noticed that jace already has a really really good work performance all we need to do is solve a case and then we're pretty much up for promotion. This is amazing. Okay, so, um, okay, we need to add some clues to the crime map. I feel like we should really do this already since the other time that we spent here at the police station, we already, like, took care of things happening at the station headquarters itself. So, I think today is the time to actually spend some time outside of the station and see what is going on. Uh, kind of investigate a little bit. This is already really full. So, okay. Okay, the suspect apparently is wearing shorts. Okay. And then we need to cross-reference the database, which I doubt we can do. It's not giving me the option to, uh, go out, if you guys get what I mean. So, we're gonna actually, um, yeah, we're gonna have to shoot somebody. <laughs> Discuss case theories. Will they stand up if we do so, or whatever? Or will they, or, or will they just sit down and stuff? Okay. And apparently we have enough clues to issue an APB at the crime map. Collecting more clues before issuing an APB will increase your ability to find the suspect. Okay, and we need to cross-reference the police database. So we need to shoot someone really quickly. A friendly introduction really- Okay, there we go. Can you, um... Uh, let's see here. More choices. Friendly. Uh, let's give him a treat or something. Please stand up. Please stand up. Uh, yeah, I hope he... Come on, we're losing time, dude. We don't have time to wait for you. Oh, sheesh. And then, yep. There we go. Yay! Cross-reference the police database with the crime reports. Uh-oh. There we go. And we gave him some treats. I love how we're literally that person who goes around and gives people candy and stuff. That's so funny. Hey, stop talking to him. You guys are at work. Ooh, this is a new moodlet, actually. Spooky sweets bestower from giving a treat. This feeling one gets from giving a treat is just as sweet as the treat itself. Cool beans. Okay, and, uh, yep. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and actually issue this APB. So how do we do that? <laughs> ah, there we go. Issue APB. And I believe we're gonna cut into a loading screen in just a second. So let's hurry up and get this over and done with. Alright, so once again, I'm gonna go ahead and cut right here. And I will see you guys wherever this loading screen takes us. Alrighty guys, the all points bulletin has been issued. A suspect fitting the APB description has been spotted in this area. And then we need to ask people first. I believe, you know what? Let's look at our notebook really quickly and see. Suspect is an art lover wearing a tank top, has black hair, young adult, female, and wearing shorts. Okay. Tank top, black hair, wearing shorts. Is a female. I mean, come on. She looks really suspicious. Dude, seriously though. I mean, yeah. Let's actually ask people, uh, ask about the suspect just really, really quickly try to get people's opinions on who it might be. There's literally nobody else here, so... And she isn't even wearing shorts. She has black hair, though, but she's not wearing shorts. I haven't seen anyone like that. Okay, we are going to ask her. Look at Jace looking so smug. Looking all smug and stuff, like he knows everything. I love how he's the one sitting down, actually. It's so funny. Uh, I'm sorry, but I can't help you. Okay, we're gonna ask some more people. Ask about suspects. Look at this outfit, by the way. Where is this outfit from? I haven't seen this before. Dude, Do, does the elders have, like, new clothes and stuff? That's really cool. I did not know that. Uh, yeah, sure. 
Anyway, it's it's this girl, I'm pretty sure. So, yep, it's it's her. So we're gonna go ahead and arrest her. You know what? Actually, let's uh, funny introduction. I don't even want to go bother developing a relationship with her if she is a criminal that we're gonna arrest anyway. I just want to kind of have the ability to ask her if she's, um, you know, if she's an art lover and stuff. So let's get to know her really quickly. Okay, speed things up a little bit. This is gonna take forever. Please tell me she's an art lover. Oh, did she just leave? You know what? It's not worth it. We're gonna go ahead and arrest her now. There we go, come on, come on. She's literally the only one who fits the description anyway. That is a tank top, so. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and cut right here once again, and I will see you guys when we're back at the police station. Okay, guys. All right, all right, all right. And it looks like we're gonna have to um, reserve pushing through with this case tomorrow since it didn't look like, oh, is she here? I don't think she is here. I don't know. Where is she? How can we interrogate her? Uh, she is not here. Dude, seriously. Come on, game. Don't don't glitch out on me, game. There are no suspects. Ugh. Did we seriously not take her with us? How, do, how does that happen, you guys? We're almost about to solve the case. Like, I don't want to spend another day at the police station just following up the case and stuff. It, this is really lame. Um, this is kind of bullshit. Honestly, like, I don't know what's wrong, but I'm pretty sure I did all the standard procedures and stuff. It's kind of lame. Whatever. Okay, dude, were you flirting with someone? No, you're already married. Nope. Okay, so yep, literally we have no option to interrogate the suspect. I wish we had an option at least to actually take her with us. Um, nope, we don't have an option to bring her here. Oh, this is so annoying, you guys. How fr freaking fr frustrating is this? I could have easily interrogated her and proven her guilt in the time that we have remaining, but whatever. So we're just gonna take some mugshots of some criminals and stuff. Okay, let's speed things up here a little bit. This is so not worth it. This is so not worth it. I really want to move forward. I don't want to waste another episode just doing random st Oh, is that her? Nope. Not her. Yeah, it's 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 gonna have to be reserved for the next part, unfortunately. As annoying as it is, because I'm really annoyed. Anyway. Okay, so let's just put her back into her... Um, yeah, and we need to search her, I guess, while she's here. To kind of be a little bit more time efficient. Speed things up here a little bit. And all of us are already familiar with all these procedures and stuff, so, okay. And we need to actually take a police report from this guy. Because we never do that that often, you know, we never take police reports and stuff, so. Yep, literally nobody's here. Nope, she's not here. I'm, I'm trying to, um, you know, I'm trying to keep an eye out for her, but I don't think she's arriving anytime soon, so. And we're literally, like, letting criminals loose. This is so funny. Okay, we already reached gold performance, so that's great. Uh, I just want to see um, what they're talking about, like the reports that they're going to file. Uh, okay, so you know what? Fine. They're leaving. I noticed that Jace has kind of lost weight. <laughs> so we're going to go ahead and actually work out with him. Speed things up a little bit. Because you guys did tell me that weightlifting kind of builds up his muscle. I actually really like his body type right now, but I mean, I feel like he could definitely use a little bit more muscle on, in him. I wish there was a way to kind of gain muscle, but not bulk up, you know, just kind of remain a little bit slender figure, um, but still have like that muscle definition, not muscle mass. Oh my gosh, I'm, go I'm getting so technical on this. Uh, but yep. She's still not here. Oh, so annoying. So, yep, there's no choice. I'm going to speed things up a little bit while we're waiting for this um, notification that our day is about to end. And hopefully we get something out of working out. <laughs> and he's really hungry as well. So that's that. 
it's taking a lot of effort actually to level up this fitness so bear witness to his fitness that's a thing that they always say in like miss usa or something or miss universe i don't know those things are really really popular in my country so anyway let's speed things up for a little bit Okay, cool, cool beans. We owned 1,000. I mean, we earned 1,320 simoleons and one vacation a day. That's not so bad. In the next part, we're probably going to continue on and actually solve this problem. But tomorrow, I'm going to record uh, the base game Let's Play because I did post in my um, channel schedule that after I finish the Thailand Royal Palace it will be replaced by the Sims 4 base game. We will resume at about episode 80 or something or episode 70 of the base game so I'm really really excited it's been so many months since I've last recorded but anyway that is going to be it for this part once again please don't forget to hit that like favorite and subscribe button because it really does help out the channel a lot you all have an awesome 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 day thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys next time bye bye